What's up, everybody? It is Peaceful here. I got another deck guide for you here today. We are looking at a negative Ravona deck today. It's going to be a ton of fun. I actually played this at the request of a viewer. I ended up loving it so much that I wanted to go ahead and feature it again now that the Ravona has been buffed and a lot more people are picking her up so that you all can have something to sort of look at, decide if it's a deck you want to try and invest in and try out on ladder. So before any, we get any further, if you are not subscribed, go ahead and please hit that subscribe button. It really helps me grow as a channel. Uh, if you enjoy the content, hit that like button. Comment down below what you think of the deck, what your favorite style of negative deck is, what cards you would maybe sub in. I really appreciate the support when you do. It really helps me grow. And uh, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into the deck. I want to go ahead and give a shout out to the viewer, Abra, who gave me this list. It's not you know a super unique list, but it is a very fun deck uh, to play. This is, a, this is the negative Ravona deck here that I have for you. Now, key things, obviously, both Ravona and Zabu help you cast negative on three. That's a super big deal. You got Darkhawk and Rock Slide. No Korg. Korg is really bad to hit off of negative, and you really is only good on turn one in this deck, so not worth running. I actually agree with that decision. Um, other than that, you see this deck is the full-on combo version for the most part. So you got Ironheart, Mystique, Darkhawk, Iron Man, Zola, and Null that if you have negatives before you play your foster will all be drawn and that's the nuts right that's the nut draw there if you have ravona zabu ravona or zabu in hand with negative and jane foster that is just the nut draw him so let's sort of go over the game plan right ravona or zabu on two negative on three jane on five that's it then you're going to draw a huge hand and you're going to play all your stuff. You're going to Arnim Zol, your Null. You're going to Arnim Zol, your Iron Man, depending on the situation. And you're going to win the game. So things to note and things I want to kind of go over. Leave a lane open. That's something that is very easy to forget. Something I forgot the first couple games I played with it. You always want to leave a lane open for your um, Null and Arnim Zola if you have the nut draw. Even if you don't, like a lot of times you can just curb Iron Man into Zola. Like, you know, turn two Ravona, turn three, you know, Rock Slide, turn four. Iron Man, turn five, Arnim Zola, turn six, you know, fill those lanes up with some stuff and win. You know, that's going to be a winning draw a lot of the times as well, even if you don't have negative. You know, those are sort of your plans. All right, you either are going to Ravona into some stuff or you're going to, you're going to negative on three, Jane on five and do the super combo thing. Now, those are really it. Those are your two main game plans. This deck can win without negative, but without Ravona or negative, it is very difficult to win. So. Uh, just keep that in mind, and it's okay to retreat. If your opponent snaps super early and you're missing all the pieces, then leave. If you have negative and Jane Foster in hand, you can stay. Even better, you can snap back. Let's go ahead and get into that a little bit. What are your snapping strategies with this deck? First up, if you have Mr. Negative in hand and you're going to play it on turn three off of Ravona or Zabu, you should have snapped. If you're snapping after the negative comes down, they're leaving. If you're snapping after the Ravona or the Zabu comes down, you're also losing a little bit of. of snap equity where your opponent is more likely to lead knowing you have discounts coming and that you're going to be able to play a lot more of your hand that's these are all things you got to keep in mind you want to snap before they know what's hit it, what's going to what's going to happen obviously sometimes you have zabu on two and you play it hoping you draw negative then you draw a negative on three yes you should still snap at that point but if you already have the combo just snap man you don't need jane that's something i hear a lot of people will say well i didn't have jane or i didn't have this piece or i didn't have that piece or i'd already draw an iron man it doesn't matter if you draw, if you play negative, this is what your deck's trying to do. All right. One of the things that if you've watched my series with Lammy on, um, you know, next little snap, one of the things he talks about a lot is knowing what the best thing your deck can do is and optimizing that, optimizing for that. And the best thing your deck can do is play Mr. Negative on turn three. So you should snap those hands. All right. You can snap a good Ravona curve. So this is something that I know a lot of people get a little scared of, but say you don't have Mr. Negative, but you have Ravona on two, Darkhawk on three. Iron Man on four, Zola on five, Null on six. That's a pretty good hand, all right? That's going to win you a lot of games. Uh, you can even, you know, obviously you could even, in that situation, you have all those cards go Null into, into Zola, if, depending on the matchup. But a lot of times without the, the flip, it's kind of hard to get that to work. But there's just a lot of different options that you can do with this deck. And you have things like Shang and stuff like that that you can curve out. So, like, you could even go, like, you know, Null on five, Mystique, Shang on six if you have Ravona in play. These are all these are all really nice lines that you have when you have a, a good Ravona curve. So make sure you're optimizing your snapping for those those good hands. Uh if you're scared to snap early, don't play the step. That's my that's my piece of advice. Don't 
you know, or just play it in a way, you know, maybe play it in like proving grounds just to try it out and have fun with it. Don't play it in a competitive setting or if you're trying to climb. You know, if you just try to play it to have fun, you don't want to snap because you want to be able to play it out. But dude, I, I get it. There was a few times where I didn't snap with this deck when I was playing it because I just wanted to see what happened. You know, I totally get that. But if you're playing this deck to climb, make sure you are snapping early. If you're scared to snap early, find the different deck to play. Something a little more reactive that you can you can snap a little more certainty. A few other notes. I've kind of touched on this already. The deck is fun, but it's very high variance. So snapping correctly is super important. If you're not doing that, you're not going to do very well with the deck. Your cube rate is going to be really low. Your win rate's not going to be great either way, but you can maximize your cube rate by snapping properly and, and still gain cubes and still climb with this deck if you are snapping correctly. Uh, and this is more, you know, just a minor note. Don't play Morph. Don't do it. Chat kept, you know, asking about Morph. I have people ask about Morph whenever I do uh, a, a negative deck. Morph's a very bad card. Even if he costs zero, he's still a very bad card. Don't play it. Uh, other than that, that's really it for this one. I hope you all enjoy the video. This will be a little bit shorter video because I didn't play this deck for quite that long because I wasn't honestly planning on making a video on it, but <clears throat> the games were too much fun. I wanted to make sure you all had uh, got to see them. So hope you enjoy and uh, I will catch you next time. Thank you so much. After getting nerfed down to 78 from 82 or whatever. All right, look, I should snap this hand too, but I don't... Oh, well, there you go. Oh, God, this is like free equity, though, chat. Yeah, this deck's in the Discord. Oh, I should snap, but then they're going to leave after... Uh, whatever. Maybe they'll stay because they're down so many cubes. It's posted in Snap General, and it doesn't... It's not the list, it's just the picture. Should be the most recent post in Snap General. Rock, rock. Yay! More time, more time! Oh, that was a bad draw. Mm -mm. Oh! How do we go over the top of the mirror? I don't want Pryo. That's like I'm scared of. And the problem, and the problem is, we're only drawing three. No, it's fine because of, because of the turn limit. I, I'm gonna play it here. Is that your first ink card? I saw. Isn't that what you sent me? Or was that a gold? Arnhem destroys Null. Yeah, we need to draw Null. Right, like here and here. <laughs> Wakanda forever. Oh my god, they're gonna Zola for us and then they're gonna make our Null huge. I am Iron Man. I am no, I like this. I like this. Because we have to play the Iron Man. We're guaranteed Null next turn. I don't think we do, because then we can't guarantee the other play. Like, don't we just let them have that? All right, we're going to let everybody have their fun. All right. Yep. Well, now we can kill it, right? Yeah. But what if they also have Shang? Do we just lose the Shang? Is that just what is that just where we're at? What if they Shang Zola here? Okay. What if they Shang Zola here? That would be the Giga Chattis play. And I would not even be mad. Dead the morph, maybe. Oh, I didn't shank. It's fine. I meant the shank. I forgot. I forgot, chat. Cut off one head, two more shall take its place. Wakanda forever. Don't we still win? 
Maybe not. It's fine, chat. What were you worried about? I legit just forgot. I got excited about the Iron Heart. <laughs> and like doing push ups and I don't know what the f I'm talking about. You know, all that good. Oh, look, we can play negative on Karmatage. That's good, right? Doubling stuff is always good. Yeah, all that. Perfect. Ooh, ooh. Is this a snap? Oof. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Come on. Don't be locked down or some boring shit. Do something fun. Sure. This lag is killing me. <laughs> oh no, they're gonna leave. Oh, that's so brutal. Don't leave. No! Victory. Why, Rickety Bridge? Why? Mm. You son of actually it doesn't matter. Oh, thank God. <laughs> All right, Mr. Negative. It's not too late. A Koi and Elias in the same deck, huh? Bold. Come on, deck. We can do it. I believe in you. Mr. Negative. We're going to have to play over here at some point, chat. I don't know how else we do it. We just got to do it. Bite the bullet. Rewarded? Yeah. Well. They just went for it. Oh, they ran away. I, I would like to say that this was my plan the whole time, but that would be a lie. Mm -mm. What? K hey, Shrews. Oh my God. This person wins and they're playing Thanos. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. I wish I could say something like I wish I could right click and like star their their name. I'm a god, chat. I'm a god. I mean, we don't have... We don't have a... What's her name? It's fine. We're going to draw it right now. It's fine, chat. It's all fine. Everything's fine. I'm not upset. I'm kind of upset. I will forgive this game if we draw... If we draw Jane right now. If we draw Jane this turn, I will forgive the game for what it's done to me. Alright, it's all forgiven. This is still the nuts. Why be fiscally responsible when you can buy... That's true. Buying pixels is a lifestyle choice. I love that. Ah! I wonder if they know they can still use that, because they can. Don't get Professor X. I mean, where do they Professor X? Damn, they didn't know. No! 
Now I get a lion, chat. I don't like getting a lion. Yeah. Why is our opponent so rude? Huh? If they snap, they definitely have a lion, right? Oh, I see. You are correct. What do you want from me? We let this die. We send this to its death. How do we dodge Elias? Just Shang Min? Y'all are so smart. Why are you so smart? Does that guarantee it? They could also reality stone it again. I don't have time to change it. I should have put one of the freaking thing. Oh my god. Oh, they left. Victory. Is it killing the devil dino still? It is better. Duh, it's better. No, it's the same. No, it's no, it's better. Of course it's better. It's safety blade! This is why Safety Blade's such a good player, chat. Look at that solid Nico on turn one. Chat, we lose. We drew Iron Man before the discount. Brutal. More safety blade. Six six. Oh God. Oh God, chat. Is this the conquerors turn? No, I'm not in that tournament, buddy. I wish. That would be cool. Blurry C. Pay attention to me. My eyes are up here, Logitech. Damn. That made it worse somehow? I'm right here. I almost didn't play this. It's that it matters because the game hates me. Um, all right, let's do the mathy here. We go turn four Iron Man. Turn five Mystique Iron Man somewhere. And we can play this together with it. I like it. Or turn four Iron Man, turn five Zola it. Is that better? But then Mystique does nothing. If only we got Null, I know. I like Rush. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't think they're gonna like this, though. I am Iron It's literally the mirror match. This is awesome. I'm not even lying. This is so funny. Oh, wait, we play these both here. Because then we can Ironheart here and then move whichever one is smaller. Do we, do we play rocks? I don't think so. No! Wait, why is it so tiny? This doesn't make any sense. Why is it so tiny? Oh, because we're playing negative decks.
I cannot believe that. Oh my god. I can't even, like, shang it, but I don't need to, right? I can't even right now with that.